Okay, so after some searching on the internet, I found really not a whole lot on how to hook up this Toyota rear diff lock um, from scratch. So I finally figured it out, and I'll try and explain what I did um, just by uh, pointing out where all the wires go. So this is the unit out of the differential. This is the factory wiring. So starting in the top corner here, the big green wire. There's uh, two big green ones. There's a straight green one and a green one with a red stripe. So the first big green one comes through on this wire and goes through to this pin on the relay. The second wire, which is the green with red stripe, uh, this is the black wire, it goes to this pin on the relay. So green wire and then green and red wire. So from there, underneath this black wire, this is this is the power wires to the motor. So you put positive and negative to these, it turns one way and, and reverse it, it goes the other way. So then these are the limit switch. This one here is the common. And then this one is either normally closed or normally open. These ones switch back and forth. Um, so starting this corner, this black wire, which is going to this bottom outside one here. This black one comes around here and goes to this pin here on the relay. The yellow one goes to the same pin on the other on, on the other relay. And then the red one, which is a common one, comes around here, jumps over top there, and goes to this pin on the relay. Just check, make sure I got that right. Yeah, and goes there. So this is a common, common one for your limit switch. All right, so that's the pin out for this. So then you need a switch, just a three position switch. The center is common, and then each each of the outside parts are the are the either are on. Um, so the center pin goes to constant positive. So here's constant positive coming in here, and then I got this jumpered over to constant positive on this one, and then negative is here, and then jumpered over to negative here on this pin. So. Center goes here to this one. The outside pin, which is the blue wire, goes to this pin on the relay. And then the other orange wire goes around the back of this pin on the relay. So this is extremely crude, but for those that can't really read schematics like me in technical detail, this is how it works by trial and error. So right now the limit switch is hooked up and it's all ready to one way. So if I switch this switch to the other side, it runs and then trips out the relay. You don't need a switch that centers in the middle, but I I just have that just because that's the switch I had. So when you when you uh, spin it the other way, it uh, it goes all the way over. And that's all there is to it. It's fairly straightforward. So then all you have to do is trace these wires back to your wiring harness inside the truck, and then um, you don't have to have them obviously like that because that's not very good so there hopefully that helps uh, some other people save about three hours of guesswork and uh, save you some money as well